Good morning, Holy Trinity. Today is Tuesday, October 24th, 2023. Please rise for our national anthem. Good morning, Titans. Um, I have a quote for you today from Neville Chamberlain. He was the Prime Minister of the UK during the beginning of the Second World War. Um, he said, in war, whichever side may call itself the victor, there are no winners, but all are losers. And um, nearly 80 years has passed since that quote was said, but we've forgotten many of the lessons that we learned from that terrible and tragic Second World War. And we still see conflicts erupting today all over the globe. We see the conflict between Israel and the Palestinians. We see the conflict in the Ukraine, as well as places like Yemen, Myanmar, and Ethiopia. So I have a prayer of peace written today, or rather not written, but uh, copied down. Uh, this comes to us from Pope John Paul II, uh, set at World Peace Day. So if you can join me in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Lord Jesus Christ, Prince of Peace, who are yourself our peace and reconciliation, and who often said, peace be to you, please grant us peace. Make all men and women witnesses of the truth, justice, and brotherly love. Banish from our hearts whatever may endanger peace. Enlighten our rulers that they may guarantee and defend your great gift of peace. May all people on earth become as brothers and sisters. May the peace you have longed for blossom forth and reign over us all. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Back to the desk. Halloweenograms. Show you scare and send your friends a sweet treat. $3 each. Halloweenograms will be delivered to homerooms on October 31st. On sale this week in the CAF. Don't be left in the cold. Show you scare. Send a treat. Attention HT students. If you are interested in joining the healthcare slash social relations club, then please sign up outside the healthcare classroom, room 246. This club is open to all students who have an interest in healthcare and service related jobs that require effective communication skills. Meetings will be held twice a month starting in November. This club will be run by two senior students as well as Mrs. Bow. The sign up sheet will be up until this Friday. Any questions, please see Mrs. Bow in room 246. Attention students interested in the health and wellness SHSM. Registration forms are due to your guidance counselors ASAP. If you, have, if you have not brought in your forms, please bring it in by Wednesday at the latest. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Bow in room 246 at the beginning of period two. Attention grade 10 to 12 students. This, this Thursday, October 26th, guidance is hosting a college panel. Representatives from Mohawk College, Fanshawe College, and Conestoga College will be here. Please see the pink flyer that your homeroom teacher received in their mailbox this morning. This is a rem reminder for all students attending the Stratford trip on Thursday this week. You must be in uniform with any shoes you wish to wear. Think comfortable for walking. Meet Ms. Bruce at the front entrance of the school as soon as you get to school. We will, we will be boarding the bus and leave at 9 a.m. sharp. Don't forget to arrange for a pickup for 7 p.m. Those interested in taking part in the Titan Scare Hunger this year on Halloween, See Mrs. Dulster or Chappian to sign up. We'll meet again Wednesday of this week. This has been Abigail Rosehart with the announcements. Now over to Ms. Williams.
excuse the technical difficulties. Okay, are we good? Okay, excuse the technical difficulties. Okay, good morning, Titans. Uh, tomorrow we have our dress down day for October. Um, just a reminder to make sure your dress wear is appropriate for school and aligns with our Catholic values. So you just dress as if you're going to the workplace. In addition to that, uh, we have our Halloween activities coming up next week, and you're going to see a promo about that coming up. And we're encouraging everybody to get into the Halloween festivity spirit and wear a costume. If you're going to wear a costume and you're starting to plan it now, again, make sure that it's appropriate for school, aligns with our Catholic school values, is not demonstrating anything of violence, doesn't have weapons. Make sure that your uh, Halloween costume is appropriate uh, for the school setting. And I'm hoping to see many of you dressed in a Halloween costume. It is not a dress down day that day. You can swap out one of your uniform pieces for orange or black, or both for orange or black. If you have swapped it out, you can wear uh, whatever shoes you want, but if you're in full uniform, your shoes have to be uniform as well. But hopefully, you'll be encouraged to come uh, dressed up in a Halloween costume. And that's all from me, over to some promos.